Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another Sons of the Forest video. Today, we're checking out the Rebreather and the Stun Gun. So, right here on the map, towards the bottom on the beach here. Show you a little tour there. Kind of trifecta between a couple of the uh, beacons and the dots here. Right on the beach, there's a small cave. When I head into this cave, um, it does have a couple of those like weird stomach things. Uh, and a couple of jump scares with bats, so I'll try to cut those out for you so not listen to those. Head right into the cave here. Um, make sure you grab a flashlight as well. All right, once you hop into the cave, you're going to see this dead man over here. A couple little things. Uh, generally some ammo here. There's going to be a rebreather tank. A um, little case here with some extra loot. There's some computers you can smash up for electronics. Head right this way. I'm going to have to uh, duck through here. There's probably going to be a few bats that are going to scare you a little bit and make, make some noise. That is my tent from earlier. Keep going, following this way. All right, once you get to this section here, you see this floaty. There's going to be a few enemies. Um, I believe I just killed them all, so they shouldn't be here again. But follow this way to... All right, and then you, once you get to this spot, there is a left and there's a right. Um, so first, we're going to go to the right because there's the stun gun. I'll show you how to get that. Then we'll come back for the rebreather because you can leave the cave with that. All right, we're just about at the end of this area here. We do have an enemy to take out. This guy generally right here has a couple good items, a grenade and some ammo usually, and maybe even some medical. But then you're going to make it towards the right here, towards the music. Music is hanging up here on the top. And then the laptop. Generally, there's a lot of babies, a little of the baby mutants over here, so be careful with those guys. Keep heading down this way. And there they are. All right, then you're going to see this guy right here, and then the stun gun. There's a couple other things hanging around over here, a couple of bottles of vodka. Um, there is a huge mofo in there. Don't want to mess with that guy. And I didn't see anything else down this way. I don't think there's any other loot or secret items. Mainly that stun gun is what you're looking for. So after that, you're just going to backtrack through the, to the split off. All right, once you get out there, you see all these bones and skulls and everything. You can head to the right. You'll see some of these life jackets in the water, this little floaty. Keep going straight past those. Get to this big open area. You just basically want to go straight through it. You'll see to the right a little bit. There's a smaller entryway you can get through. You have to crouch to get through here. All right, then this brings you out here to this bigger area. There's a couple of loots that you can get, you can grab. Um, there is a few mandibles if you want to eat any of those, legs, arms, all the goodies. Um, a couple of things of vodka, there's some cans over here of some energy drinks. Oh, and careful you don't fall into the water because there is a shark in here somewhere. Not sure where he's at the moment, but after you grab all that stuff, or if you follow down to the right here, this will take you directly over here to a couple extra things of loot. And the rebreather. And then after that, you basically are ready to go. Just watch out for the shark. But then you can jump into the water. Head all the way down. Oh, the shark actually looks like he's dead. I don't know how he died, but um you're gonna want to go towards the left, and then you're gonna be heading out towards the ocean there, and then you're pretty much good to go after that. You got the rebreather and the stun gun with a few bullets for the gun, as well as a grenade. Grenade is very useful, especially in this cave, because there's a lot of those uh, chest tickler things. So yeah, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Check out some of the other guides I made if you ever need help with anything. And uh, stay tuned for some videos. I have a video coming out on this of me playing through this. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.